Hi. What's impressed me as part of the group that has shaped the programme is the emphasis on the individual as a leader. So it's not about running your college, it's about you as a leader. And the programme is built around that. Okay, we've worked really hard to design something prestigious and new, which hasn't been in place for years, certainly wasn't around when I became a principal, was thinking about becoming a principal. Um, it's never too late, whether you're new in post or been in post for a long time, this is going to be exciting, it's going to be different, there's going to be some very challenging uh, bits to it, there's going to be some very interesting people. Um, for me as an individual, I think this is going to give me uh, a real lift in my practice and give me some real exciting things to take away and use in my day-to-day -day job. Um, I think it's going to give me some really good ideas of how I can take the college forward uh, and to make it and myself more resilient. Um, and I think this is going to be good for the sector because this really is prestigious. The involvement of the side business school is a real coup for us. Um, we need to make sure that we make the most of it, we get the most value out of it. I urge you to sign up because it's only going to be as good as its participants. I think the, the big impact for me um, from coming on the programme is to question some of those ideas, some of those approaches, some of the things that I've taken probably for granted and not provided a, a really critical I think, and reflective view on why uh, and how I do things. And I think I'm going to go back after this um, and um, already I'm feeling quite different about how I might approach things and I think it's really difficult sometimes to be curious and open and uh, vulnerable um, around how you approach your work and I think coming here and, and having this space creates an environment where you can do that and that's uh, been extremely helpful for me. You know I say to my colleagues David Beckham when he was arguably the greatest football in the world still trained every day. You know, Usain Bolt is the fastest man in the world. He still trains every day. He's trying to get better. He's trying to improve. He's actually racing against himself now to try and beat things. You know, at what point do you stop? Uh, for me, I'm really looking forward to this and I urge everybody to take part.